I help restore this wetland right here. This is big blue stem in the Bee Hunter Marsh in Indiana. It's plantings like this that provide critical habitat for not only wildlife, but it helps with uh, reducing flooding because this is down in a wetland. Uh, conservation makes all the sense in the world because our land is the most valuable thing we have, protecting the topsoil, uh, building it to be a healthier soil and protecting our water are the components, are the things that will make agriculture secure and lasting for generations to come. What advice would you give to uh, farmers who are interested in trying to do more conservation on their land, including their crop land? Well, I think more important than ever will be what we do on working lands. I expect in the next Farm Bill we'll have a working lands program, and that'll be where we use cover crops, uh, we use no-till, we use nutrient management. All of those things can help hold our soil in place, but also keep the very expensive nitrogen phosphate in place and out of the gulf. And we don't, we can't afford to go down the Gulf and get it back out and bring it back. So uh, we need all the tools and cover crops, no-till and nutrient management are the tools that allow us to do that in the future and grow higher yields than ever. We now know how to do that, the management systems that work, the yields and the net income that can come from being a good steward of the land. What are some of the things that uh, you do on your own land, Ray? What I do on my own land is I have conservation buffers along every stream. I've restored wetlands. I have grass waterways with these native prairie grasses. Uh, I try to use native plants in my restoration, but then on my working ground, I'm trying to grow the biggest yields ever with the least input. So we use variable rate nitrogen so that we put the nitrogen on when most needed. We use Austrian winter peas to grow the next year's nitrogen for the corn crop. We use crop rotation and we use uh, grid sampling and so we do lots of things to make sure that we use our inputs as efficiently as possible so that it's used by the plant and keep it out of our water, keep our streams healthy and clean and clear.